welcome back to the evening's office so today i thought i'd do a bit of a vlog where i'm back normally working in my office getting work done for my digital product business that i build and i thought i would show you a couple of things that are going on behind the scenes um, and introduce you a little bit to kind of what the evening's office membership looks like as well so if you're thinking that you want to work with me for the next year working on building your business and all of those wonderful things i thought i'd kind of show you a little bit behind the scenes of what that's like um, and also some of the other co-workers inside there as well so a little bit of an interesting work day today so let's actually start with the day so let me just get you it set up and then we will quickly chat about what's going to happen throughout the day okay so basically at this point this is a little bit later on in the day that i'm talking to you guys because i wanted to get like a whole load of stuff and um, organized beforehand but i've already gone ahead and done my to do list again i use the full focus planner i have a brand new one um which i think i unboxed in a previous vlog with you guys um so i already have that up and running i've already been using it and um yeah i've just got quite a few things i want to get done today and of course i just use a highlighter just to tick everything off when it's ready um but basically today I woke up this morning, I went for like a long walk because that's kind of like how I like to get out of the house, especially when I'm like spending all day at home um, because I'm not going anywhere this evening or today or anything like that. Um, and then I've got some orders that I want to go through in terms of my Etsy shop and my Amazon shop just to make sure everything's gone smoothly. And also I am doing quite a bit of work inside of my membership group. Um, I It's so cool. I'll actually show you inside of it in a bit and I'll show you a couple of things that members have been doing as well. Um, but yeah, just a, it's so fun. It's been so nice to go back to it as well after Christmas. Um, and to basically catch up with what everyone else has been doing and everyone is so motivated to start pushing forward with their business which in turn motivates me so that's actually been really exciting so i'll show you guys a little bit of that i also have some video content that i've got to record for my even office as well because um i do like weekly motivation videos in there so yeah basically i'm going to sit down and do a couple of those today which is why i've kind of like gone to the effort today is to look a little bit nicer than normal i use a program called loom to record my some of my videos for my um, membership group so it's like a really amazing program so another in another vlog i will show you guys how i use that what i use it for in terms of how it helps me build my business i also have to sort out a couple of emails for my email subscribers that i want to send out and um, if you guys have been following along on my kind of YouTube channel um, vlogs that I've been doing, I basically try and listen to at least one um, podcast or one lecture or one talk or something to do with marketing, business and finance. Um, per day so at least one i class it as like my um my little university degree because i just want to and i've talked about this in previous vlogs i just want to understand marketing a little bit more i want to understand business a little bit more and of course finance a bit more i am someone that like there's no stopping with learning i'm learning inside my business every single day i continue to learn because i continue to try and grow my business and i make mistakes and all that stuff so yes yeah, so that's something i'm going to do today i'm going to pick out i think whilst i work um i'm going to pick out like a lecture to listen to on marketing or a talk or something but yeah so that's gonna be business related and on top of that for christmas time i asked for um two books from a kind of business owner herself and um, but also she's quite well known on instagram as well and basically her name is brianna west i think it's brianna west i think is how you say it um, and she basically does a lot of mindset motivation content on instagram i'll try and link her instagram in like my description box if i remember because i'm terrible with that and um, but just to say her name anyway and basically for christmas my partner picked me up two of her books and I've got The fa the Mountain Is You and I've got I Am The Hero Of My Own Life. And The Mountain Is You is basically a bit of a self-help kind of book. I think it's more just helping you work through things and stuff like that, which is really great. But then the um, I Am The Hero Of My Own Life is an actual book that you can go through and fill in yourself and it gives you prompts and all of that really fun stuff. So what I'm doing at the moment is like I'm taking a notebook and I'm just picking out sections of this book and I'm like just using it as a way to just ease myself into the new year really and really think of in terms of particularly business but also obviously in my normal everyday life just think of 
like you know how i can improve on things um how i can stop doing things like self-sabotaging especially in terms of things like my business and um, where you know i really have sh struggled with that in the past I and mean, i've talked to you guys as well about like that kind of magpie effect and running off at something else and i'm just really focusing this year and i know i'm not going to be perfect at it but i'm really focusing this year particularly with my business but also just with myself in general um, I really want to focus on just being consistent and knowing what I want to achieve and just sticking to it throughout the year without constantly running around and getting distracted by something else and going to chase something else because I've done that before in the past and it just doesn't work. It just doesn't get you anywhere, I don't feel like, in your business. I feel like actually consistency and just sticking with what you know you want to do is a lot more effective and I've seen that inside my business myself. So... That is something I'm going to be doing hopefully at the end of the day. I'll just give myself like half an hour or something to do that. But let's actually get on with a little bit of work now. And then I will start recording some videos for my Evenos office membership as well. Um, and then I'll hopefully show you behind the scenes. Oh, and I also have um, hopefully something I'll be able to unbox with you a little bit later. It's something that's like a staple in my life um, that I thought, why not? Because it always comes really nicely packaged. So I thought I would kind of just share that with you guys. It's a little fun something inside this office. It's not all boring work all day long but speaking of i actually do need to get on and do some work so i will put you into a time lapse so we can just actually get focused on work and then i will see you after it it's cold for a little bit and actually show you a little bit of some of the things that I'm working on. So I'm working inside of my Evenos office membership. So if you don't know what that is, it's basically where you can come and you can work with me. You can come into the office and there are training courses in there which teach all about building a digital product business from scratch. It's completely beginner friendly. And also there's a wonderful community in here. And basically we talk like on a daily basis about building digital products, about putting things into place. And I wanted to just give a shout out to and one of my new members who's come in and like just because I'm just so proud of her basically she came in and um, her name is Cherie so if she's watching this hello um, but she basically came in and she had like a good general idea of what she wanted to do with in terms of building a digital product business what kinds of you know digital products she wanted to create and how she wanted her business to grow but it was very like there were lots of different ideas and there were just lots of things she wanted to do all at once and she was finding it a little overwhelming and within literally just a couple of interactions and stuff the even owns office she put everything together and i created some video help and support for her and we've been having chats as well in the office which is what i do with every co-worker in my office and within literally a couple of days she has everything crystal clear she knows exactly how to lay out her business and she knows what to focus on and start building straight away. And honestly, I was just so proud of how fast she's done it. And there's so many of those inside the community who are doing amazing things as well. There's another member as well that I have in there um, called Ina, who's absolutely wonderful. And she is basically getting ready to launch an online course that she's done. She already has you know, a client who wants to do it. Just is so many amazing things. Um, and then I also have another member in there as well called Wendy, who is taking her business slower because that's how she feels comfortable doing it. But she's like so far compared to when I first met her and the things that she, I think, thought that she could do. And now she is just putting together her business. She's already getting favorites in her shop. She's already already adding products into her shop and she's probably pretty soon going to start making her first sales and building her business and she wants to take it very very slowly as well so you can still 
build and i always say that you can still build a digital product business at any pace that is right for you that is one of the beauties of a digital product business it grows with you as you go along and there are so many other members inside of there as well and i've welcomed in a bunch of new members as well and you are always welcome like if if any of you guys want to join the Evenos office and come in and you want to work with me and help you get yourself sorted and organized to build your digital product business i will leave the link to the Evenos office down below it might be on a waiting list at the moment or it might be available for you to hop in and um, but i thought let's like show you a little bit behind the scenes so you can see what it's like inside of the office and i realize how close i am to the camera so i'm really sorry that i was like really up close then um but yeah let's have a look so this is the Evenos office and it is broken down so simply so you can see all of the elements here and we're in the co-workers community at the moment which is where like all of my members chat away and all of those wonderful things and I create content every week inside of the Evenos office as well as when you use this little button here because there's quite a few people who message me but as well as you when you use that little button here you can directly chat to me um, and I will be there to support you every step of the way so I create helpful video tutorials for you that are specific to you and your business. You're not trying to piece it together from little bits that you find online and little bits of information. You literally just have direct access to me. And that was exactly like the way that me and Cherie communicated just to help her clarify everything that she wanted to do. And I won't show you um, exactly what she's done because obviously it's her piece. So you can only see a little section of it here. She's able to literally put all of her visuals together to understand exactly what sections of her business she's gonna work on at what time. Um, and we were just talking about it and she was just saying thank you so much for sharing this and walking me through this process i had no idea how to do such a deep dive into finding my target audience i truly appreciate your patience with me as i figured it out and all the knowledge so grateful and like honestly this is what i like absolutely love about my business if you need help figuring out how to build your digital product business how to put it together and even how to grow that business from scratch it is all here inside the evenos office and you can pop in you can join you can stay for as long as you want i have it open access so you know you're just paying on a monthly basis or you can choose to purchase for the entire year and treat it like a course so you just make a purchase um, and then you have access to it throughout the entire year and you can chat to me you can do all the fun stuff um but yeah basically i just wanted to um just share a little bit with you guys and just share a little bit about what goes on inside the office the office is my absolute pride and joy and i love like watching people come in and build their digital product business get so much clarity because that is the key to building your business if you spend all of your time in overwhelm and confusion you'll never just see the clear path and get it done and i actually find one of the ways that i tend to help people most when they come into the office it's because they come in and they just want guidance and support to know how to put their business together. Most likely, a lot of the time, they even come in with already an idea of how they want to build their business in terms of you know what products they might want to create or who they, that, their target audiences they want to serve. But they just are looking for like someone to be able to tell them, okay, then we do this and that next step and that next step, and just to get rid of all the overwhelm. And trust me, I've built. Um, a number of digital product businesses. I've sold thousands of products and I've hit so many of the hurdles that everyone comes in and so often they think like, oh my gosh, this is the thing that's gonna stop me building my business because I can't do this. And I'm like, I promise you, it won't stop you from building your business at all. And once we get you over that hurdle, you'll be flying away with it. So yeah, I just thought I'd kind of like share a little bit of what's going on behind the scenes with the office. Um, and also obviously to let you know that I will leave a link to it in the description box below. You can join, you can try it out. Like I said, it's open access. You can come and go whenever is right for you because the point of the office is not like, I want it to be support for you. And I want it to be a place where you can come just have access to me and help and support when you need it. Because a lot of building your business is you putting the time and effort into building that business. So you need time to do that, but also a support system. That's what it is. I'm, I was just thinking today that, um, and this is back to behind the scenes, just me as my own business owner working on things. But I was kind of thinking today that like, I want to, I think, cap how many people come into the Evenos Office community. And um, just because the value that I get from the community is being able to interact with every single person in the community and actually knowing them by name, knowing what business they're building, knowing how to support them. And I think when it gets 
too big i've sometimes like almost started to reach a point where i can't communicate constantly with everybody and um, and so i think actually giving myself a cap on how many people can be in the office um, and how many people i'm going to be able to serve in the office at once to help build their business is something that i'm definitely going to be like implementing i think um in the next couple of months and um, so yeah it's like it's an interesting one for me with building a membership i know that a couple of members inside of my um co-working community they are building their um, membership sites online courses etsy shops for printables in specific whether it's art printables or planner printables or workbooks and um, there's people who want to build youtube channels in there and like it's just such an amazing community because there's that diversity as well you're not just seeing what you know one stream of income looks like you're seeing how you can stack those on top of each other to make even more income um, but at my end as a business owner it's really kind of like made me focus down actually and streamline my business even more because I know that I want my business to be about the Evenos Office community, about my courses, about my YouTube channel and about my Etsy shop um, and that's like my, my amount really, that's what I'm focused on and even then that's quite a lot of different platforms and products so even then I have to prioritize at times which ones come first but I'm very very grateful the fact that I make my full-time income from digital product businesses and um, I've had some amazing amazing times with building my business that have even like the income and stuff has, has floored me um, and my focus for my year when it goes into and it comes into like me just being a business owner is to continue the growth of that but also most importantly to learn how to make it easier for myself so i'm not running around constantly and um, like i always talk about this like having that kind of like octopus on roller skates effect where i'm trying to do 50 different things at once and go in 10 different directions or eight different directions i suppose um at once like in reality i just don't think it's effective i've tried it and it's very very tiring and you don't you know giving 10 percent of something into you know a part of your business just doesn't have the same power and impact as giving you know a hundred percent or let's be honest here seventy percent sixty percent because we all have down days and, and hard times and um, which is why i really talk about inside of the office about the importance of focusing on getting clear on first of all i should say getting clear on the trajectory of your business and how you want it to grow and what you want it to achieve and then breaking it down into manageable chunks that you can work on at a time and that over time will help your income grow your sales grow your traffic grow and all of those important things and it's okay not to be perfect at this and i want to like just i suppose finish this vlog well actually i've just got one more thing i've got to do which is to show you something but just to kind of finish off the chat side of this vlog um i just wanted to say that like if you were thinking of building a digital product business this year or if you already have one because obviously like my evenos office is open for anybody and my youtube channel is open for anyone whether you are you know in the process of building your business or whether you already have one um but if you are i think like the one thing that i want to really promote on my youtube channel is that it's totally okay for this not to be a perfect journey i think there are so many things out there on youtube and on the big online world that promote almost like this perfect linear progress to building a business and that you know that that kind of stereotype idea of like you start making 10 pounds and then the next month you're making 20 pounds the next month you're making 100 pounds next month you're making a thousand pounds and as if it just linearly grows like that and the reality is that's not how most businesses that i have seen i have worked with and obviously my own businesses grow they just don't sometimes you have really great times and then you have difficult times and in the difficult times in your business you have to learn okay what am i missing here that you know help me achieve those good times and the more that you sometimes have those downs the more that you learn how to get better and better at kind of making those downs less down if that makes sense um but yeah so i just wanted to i suppose like before i just do the final thing which i'm going to unbox and um, a little something with you because i thought i don't want it all to be about work um but i just wanted to like say that if you were somebody that you are thinking about building a business and perhaps you're worried that like well what if i can't do it and what if i'm a failure at it or you know what if it doesn't work if i don't make any sales or maybe you're already you already have a, a small online business and you're like i'm really struggling like you know is this normal is this the thing i want to always be like you know 
real with it um that yes there are times when you're gonna have difficult days in your business and difficult weeks in your business and you either decide to throw in the towel then and there and it's not right for you or you decide you know what i'm just gonna weather this storm keep working on my business keep staying accountable and building it and eventually i'll get over that hurdle and i'll see my business boom and continue to grow and i've had that so many times where like i've felt like it's really difficult um, and something's not working not working not working and then boom it just suddenly works and it suddenly starts jumping and then I spend my time figuring out okay how did I do that so I can replicate it again um but yeah so I'm just oh, I've got hair in my mouth there lovely um but yeah I am just basically now gonna go grab my final thing to unbox with you guys so before you go there's a lot of something that's not so work related and then I will um basically see you guys next vlog but also I'd love to know like if you want to like I know not everybody likes to add things into comments and stuff but if you want to and um, let me know how you're getting with your business or your business idea particularly if it's like a digital product business but even if it's not are you you know finding it really easy at the moment are you enjoying it are you struggling are you struggling to get off the hurdle like you know to even begin it i would love to know because i think we're all in this together and you know every business owner understands how difficult it can be and how there are ups and downs in every business so i would love to know if you want to you don't have to um leave a comment in the comment section and also don't forget if you do want help definitely check out my membership group i'd love to work with anyone who needs support with building their digital product business like that's the whole point of me building my membership and my youtube channel so I mean, anyway stop waffling i'm gonna go get that parcel do you know what i was gonna go get the parcel but i thought actually why not just take you downstairs with me because it's three flights of stairs um, and also there are things that i I'm not going to show you today in this vlog but i will show you in a future vlog that we've done to the house namely there's some artwork that has come into the house so you might be able to see it a little bit here um but i won't reveal the whole thing to you she says and i'll probably show you all of it there um but there's some like really nice artwork that we did we did like a massive like um homeware shop home decor shop um straight after christmas and yeah basically just stock the house up with some really nice stuff so you can hear my dog crying his eyes out because he wants to go in the kitchen come on then also like i'll give you a little bit of a sneak peek of the house so you can see what it's looking like again i won't spoil it today um but i will show you guys in a future video so the lights gone really orange okay so i'm hoping that that is a good place to unbox something with you um i'm really sorry if the lighting is terrible and things like that but i thought just to bring you down if i just go get just get something to open this with um basically i just thought to kind of uh, i say that now and it's got a tab on it i just picked up from um chanel and i thought they always unbox stuff so nicely so i thought i would kind of share it with you um but it's only a little little something it's actually from their makeup section i just thought that i, I thought the last time i got something from chanel was for someone's present um and basically they just their packaging at the moment is so beautiful because obviously it's like the last of the festive season and stuff like that this is no different and i just thought i've got to share that because it's only a little something i treat myself to um and actually it's a bit of a restock as well but look at that just isn't that just absolutely gorgeous not like anything crazy expensive or anything like that but i just thought i just was like the beautifulness of this i actually kept this ribbon from um the last thing that i purchased as well from them and there's there's the back i thought for all of my ladies who like a little bit of glam not a crazy amount but a little bit um i don't have like a crazy collection or anything like that i just thought to unbox it with you guys because um some of you i know like a little bit of um a little bit of luxury too so inside of here you just they just open it and there's like a little box here it comes with a little Chanel pouch. It actually just has like the complimentary little gift things that come with it. So it's not the actual finished product. Because the finished thing is, looks really small, but it's actually the Vitalumia Aqua um, Skin Perfecting Foundation. Oh, there you go. And the reason why I usually get, like for my makeup, I usually get just the normal Vitalumia one. But for like months, they have not had um the skin tone one that i have which is uh 20 i think it's called or something um and so i was like i'm running out massively um and i need to like i wear it on most days and things so i decided to get the vitalumia aqua version which i think is like the light version of it 
So I'm going to test this out and see how this does. I actually mix it with another foundation, so it's not my only foundation. Yeah, I thought I'd test that out and see how it does. Um, but I thought to just share that with you guys because I always just think the packaging is so lovely. And in terms of branding, not many people do it like Chanel. So anyway, I'm really sorry if the lighting here is very like yellow and stuff like that. I will eventually learn how to move you guys around my house a little bit more. But I just thought to finish off this vlog with my dog crying because he wants a treat and um, yeah, me downstairs instead. But I'll see you in the next vlog, guys. And I hope you're enjoying these vlogs. Let me know by giving it like a like or something like that if you do enjoy it. Before I go, don't forget that I will link everything that I featured, including this, if you want to check it out as well. Um, but I will give you a review on how that, that you know, whether the Vitaly Met Aqua is the same kind of thing as what I'm used to um, in a future vlog. Um, but I will link everything else that I've mentioned inside this video, including the membership site. If you do want to join and join our community of people building their digital product businesses this year and as always don't forget to subscribe if you do enjoy these vlogs as well my subscriber count is growing again it's so wonderful i think i'm about to hit uh, 31k which is amazing so thank you so much and i will see you in the next video guys bye it's cold outside.